Hi, this is Jeffrey Ross with another Autoblog Shortcut, and today we're here checking out the 2014 Chevy Impala and the next generation Chevrolet MyLink. And we're here with Jeff Massimella, and he's going to tell you more about it. Hi, Jeff. Thanks. I'm the uh, engineering group manager for the next uh, generation of Chevy MyLink, and I want to show you a few things with the system today that we find uh, very exciting. So to start with here, we have a highly graphical system, you know, very high graphics on the home screen here. I'm going to go ahead and press on the nav icon show you our great 3D navigation system. Um, it shows 3D navigation for uh, most major metropolitan areas in a really graphical format that's uh, um, pleasing to the, the customer for sure. Um, we also have four themes in the system, so we allow customization of both the center stack and the, um, the DIC, the Driver Information Center in the cluster, simply by going into Settings, Display, Themes, and we have four of them we can choose from. We're seeing Main Street right now. We'll switch it over to Contemporary. And you're going to see that both the screens changed um, for their, you know, their, their fonts, their icons, their colors. Move over to an edge format, kind of a, a youthy format with some good, uh, good graphics there. Also in the cluster again. And then finally a velocity theme. Taking you back to a very clean and, and uh, good environment. So uh, some other stuff I want to show you today was some of the customization we can do in the system. Um, as you see on the audio screen here, we have something called an app tray in our system. The app tray allows you to put five um, functions up there or uh, applications that allow you to quickly switch between them. So I can, there, it's located on every screen. I can go back and forth between them quickly. I can change that simply by holding on the, uh, the home screen here and say I'm not a Pandora user. Um, we have a lot of stuff up there right now, it appears, but I'm not a Pandora user. Um, but I'd like to have my navigation up there. I can just drag my nav up, I can put it wherever I want, exit the home screen, go back to the audio page, now I got navigation up there and I brought Pandora out and again it allows me to quickly go back and forth between things. To go uh, further into that customization, we've taken favorites to a whole new level in the system. You see some things down here, radio stations. We allow it to be favorites in the new Chevy MyLink for navigation um, destinations or phone contacts or um, even media selections. So as I'm listening to a song here, I can press and hold. It's a song on USB. Um, I can choose to store the artist, the album, the song, or the genre, so I'll choose the artist. And you see now that artist is saved as a favorite. And any media selection I have or device in the car that has that artist on it, if I press it, it'll create a playlist on the fly and allow me to um, get a playlist of that artist only. Last thing I wanted to show you here was a great new um, feature that we have located behind the screen. We have a power motorized storage bin behind the screen. It's a flocked bin, it's got a USB port, and it's lighted. And one of the great features associated with this is we offer a valet feature in the system that allows you to secure the storage. So in settings, simply go to valet mode, type in a code, and uh, only the code you know, obviously, and then when you give your keys to the valet, if your phone or any personal objects are locked in there, they won't be able to access it. The button will actually be locked out so they can't open the code or open the bin until the, the correct code is put in. All right, well, thank you very much. And that's the next generation Chevy MyLink.